test effect or can i say 3d logo yes using photopy go to pixel app do the designing come to photopy and mock it up this ai here gets you covered as you can see this is my name jack's graphic this is how beautiful and how classy the 3d effect is here on my screen look at this one too this is jack's graphics this one too are you seeing that this is fucking awesome are you seeing how it looks like it is sharp and almost it is top notch like there is is in fact it's uncomparable guys just look take a look at this admire it you like it right so into today's tutorial guys i'll be putting you through on how you can actually design this for yourself you can brand your name pay nobody again you can brand your name using this particular ai so all you need to do is this guys follow my step watch carefully watch the entire video and believe me you too can be able to get this done on your own without you paying time so all i need you to do is this please i'm begging you if you are new to my channel subscribe yeah subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification side and reason for you to turn on the notification side is to always get notified whenever jack's graphic drop a new tutorial video thank you and guys let me see you at the end of this video stay tuned guys the first thing you need to do is to head over to your phone browser so once you come here once you are here in your phone browser first thing you need to do is this guys just let me on my data so first thing you need to do is this normally you guys know the, the name right so i'll be using image creator so just type your bin this is bin then you go to your bin image creator once you open your bin image creator this is how it always look like do you understand so once this comes pops up like this next you need is this convert this your screen to desktop screen so for you to do that you click on this arrow facing up by the side the top corner side then you see as you can see you can see desktop side so just make it desktop side and once you make it desktop side can you see it has changed automatically now watch carefully i have created my account and that is why you are seeing this name here so no more Yes, I've created my account. That's why you're seeing this name here. This name Solomon here. Good. Then after that, now, if you've not created an account, I will advise you do so. So after you've created your account, the next step you need to take is just click on this image. Watch, guys. Click on this image. You see that? Uh -huh. So once you click on that image now, guys, let's see what pops up. So you will see a different images of what people created here using being image creator. Are you getting that? So now perfect. If you like, no subscribe. I know many have not subscribed and yet you are watching this video. You better hit that red button, subscribe and turn on notification sign so you don't miss my videos. Then after that, you click on this create button you are seeing here. So once you create, click on this create, this create button, look at similar things that people are actually creating here just by putting in the right prompt for this you see that so after this now next thing you need to do now let's just go copy the prompt that i particularly will be using to generate that particular pictures that i show you earlier do you grab it so let's just wait guys let me paste in the prompt so this is the prompt read carefully guys i hope you can see it on my screen here so generate a 3d image where so this place now just change the name to Jack's graphic. You see that. So when you change that name to Jack's graphic, then remove this. Okay, let's put it this way. Generate a 3D image where. Okay, let me put it this way. Generate a 3D effect. Let me put it this way. Generate. A 3D test, a 3D test effect with with the name. The 3D test effect with the name just graphic and large. In large format with a handsome 
Mm, generate a 3D test effect with the name Jazz Graphic in large format with, with a handsome 19, year, 19 years old girl sitting on Jazz Graphic this thing. So let's generate. Watch and see. Let's see what the outcome will look like. Let's see how the outcome will look like, guys. Let's see how the outcome will look like. So as you can see, it's generating pictures concerning the prompt that I put. So guys, look at this. I send this. You see how this looks like, but I don't too like this. I don't like that. So let me shake this, guys. Watch and see. I don't like the pictures that this prompt gave me. So let me change the prompt, guys. So let me let me use this prompt. Can you see that? Create a vibrant 3D scene with jazz graphic and a handsome boy sitting casually on the jacks graphic large logo. Dress him trendly, casually, stuff like that. Then you click click on generate. Let's see how that will look like guys so watch please watch if you've not subscribed subscribe to my channel and i'm begging you for definitely you'll be learning values with jack's graphic thanks and let's see how the prompts or let's see the pictures that this prompt will give us okay look at this look at this look at this this is fine right you like this isn't it you see how this looks like look at this wow this is beautiful look at this look at this this is awesome so guys this is actually the easiest way then if you want to download this now you need to click just click on this part here you click here this is where i circled for you so once you click here you have that download button then you download it so this is just the easiest way you can actually generate a 3d test effect for yourself your client for your social media handle stuff like that so thank you and please see you guys on my next tutorial video i love you guys bye bye